Hello everyone. Welcome to MS Apti webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to rename a device in Microsoft Intune. We can easily rename a device which is enrolled in Intune. The rename device action lets you specify a new name to the device that is enrolled in Microsoft Intune. After we rename the device, the device's name is changed in Intune and also device name is changed on that device. There are many use cases for this option. For example, you have Windows device where the device name is the default desktop and some random alphabets and numbers. And now you want to rename it to something meaningful. Maybe you have used Autopilot on your machines which provides host names to all the machines as per the configuration in the Autopilot profile. And now you want to set a different name on few of the machines so you can easily identify from Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. First, we need to access and log in to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. We can access Microsoft Endpoint Manager using the URL HTTPS colon double slash endpoint.microsoft.com. Click on Devices. Click on All Devices. Click on Device Name for which you want to rename the device. In this example, we will click on this Windows 10 device. As we can see, the device name is default name desktop hyphen some random alphabets and numbers. Let me click on it. Now we will be on overview page. There are two ways to rename a device in Microsoft Intune. Under manage click on properties and here we have an option to rename this device. The second option is on overview tab. On overview page select three dots and click on rename device option which is going to open the same option. In the rename device blade, tap the new name in the text box. We need to follow this guideline while assigning a new name to the device. We can use letters, numbers and hyphens. No space or special character. Let me enter a new name lab win 10 hyphen pc01 this is the name which you want to assign to this windows 10 device we can also use device specific values to the name that we will cover when we use configuration profiles option if you want to restart the device after renaming it choose yes next to restart after rename you can select no to skip device restart after rename operation and later point of time you can manually restart the device yourself. Since this is a test environment, we will go with yes. Now click on rename. We can see the confirmation message restart initiated. Right now we can see rename device action status is pending. When the process is completed, Based on action, we will get an updated status under the device action status of the rename device action. Now, before we go back to Windows 10, uh, let me refresh the web page and let's see the actions. We can see two actions are there rename device and restart, and status is pending. Now, let's go back to Windows 10 device. First, let me show you the current host name of this Windows 10 computer. Let's right click on start button and click on system. We can see the current device name is there, desktop hyphen some random alphabets and numbers. Uh, in couple of minutes, you will see a pop-up message box about the restart. But if you don't want to wait, you can also perform manual synchronization with Intune. So let me click on home. Uh, let's click on accounts, click on access work or school, click on info and let's perform the manual synchronization by clicking on this sync button. 
the sync is in progress uh, let's wait for the sync to complete the process now in couple of minutes you will see a pop up message box about the restart as you can see you are about to sign out and you will get around 2 minutes more before the restart of the device will start uh, let me click on close and now let me show the current device name let's right click on start button click on system and here we can see now we have two device names this is the old one and this is the new one which we have given from the microsoft endpoint manager admin center you can also manually restart the device if you want so let me close it uh, since we don't want to wait for it uh, let's uh, right click on start button and select restart after restart let's sign in again using the credential of our user test user 2 first let's check the computer's new name right click on start button select system we can see the new computer name lab win 10 hyphen pc01 that means we can say we have successfully rename a device using microsoft endpoint manager admin center let me click on home click on accounts click on access work or school uh, i'm going to perform the manual sync again so we can see the detail in microsoft endpoint manager admin center okay we can see the sync was a successful now let's go back to endpoint manager admin center we can see the old name of the device here uh, let's refresh the web page now we see the device name is changed to new name device name is lab win 10 hyphen a pc01 check the device action status as well rename completed restart is also completed so under device action status we can see the updated status of the renamed device action which is completed successfully it is very easy to rename device in intune using microsoft endpoint manager admin center so that concludes the video on how to rename a device in microsoft intune thank you all for watching this video have a nice day